Hi kids, it's me again, Teacher Donna, and welcome to Circle Time. Well, today's Circle Time, we are going to learn some vocabulary about tools. Can you say that word? Tools. And today, I will show you some pictures. And these are examples of tools that some people, maybe you or me or your mom, or your daddy are using when they are at work. Okay, so let's have the first picture. I will share the screen first. Okay, now look at the screen. So here on the left side, these are examples of tools. Can you say that again one more time? Tools. That's right. And these are examples of tools. Now, let's have the pictures on the right side here. So, can you tell me who is she? She's a doctor. Yes or no? Yes. How about this man? Who is he? He's a policeman. Right? Now, we have here... Do you know who is he? He's a, he's the one, what? He's the one killing fires. He is a fireman. Now, let's have number four. Who is he? He works at the farm and he is a farmer. Okay, one more time. We have here the doctor, policeman, fireman, and farmer a farmer okay now let's go back to the pictures here let's have number one can you please repeat after me okay so teacher donna will read the words and you are going to repeat after me are you ready so number one this is a stethoscope stethoscope that's right. So this is a stethoscope. And doctor or a doctor uses a stethoscope. Okay, so when the doctor treats a patient or if he or she needs to examine something, then he or she uses a stethoscope. One more time. Stethoscope. This is a stethoscope. Next, number two. What is this? Please say radio. Radio. So, a policeman uses a radio. One more time. A policeman uses a radio. So, this is a radio. Now, let's have number three. Please say ladder, ladder. A fireman uses a ladder. A fireman uses a ladder. Very good. So that's number three. Now let's have number four, rake. So this is a rake. And a farmer uses a rake. A farmer uses a rake. Okay? So, one more time. We have stethoscope, radio, ladder, rake. Good job. Now, let's have the next slide. Can you please tell me what is this? Caesars, right? They are scissors. How about this one? Do you know what is this? It's a paintbrush. Paintbrush. Good job. Now let's have number seven. Please say computer. Computer. And number eight. Please say microphone microphone 
And now let's have these pictures on the right side. So here we have a hairdresser. Hairdresser. So this is a hairdresser. Now let's have this one. Who is he? So as you can see, he is holding a paintbrush and he is a painter. Painter. That's right. Now let's have number seven. Who is he? He is a businessman. He is a businessman. Next one, we have number eight. So this is the last number we have. Singer. Singer. Okay, one more time. Who is he? He is a hairdresser. A hairdresser uses scissors. Number six, who is he? He is a painter. Painter. A painter uses a paintbrush. Okay, next, number seven, a businessman. Who is he? He is a businessman. And a businessman uses a computer. A businessman uses a computer. And last but not the least, singer. Again, who is he? He is a singer. A singer uses a, what is this? Microphone. A singer uses a microphone. Good job. Okay, so before we, before we have a test, you are going to have homework today, okay? But before that, let's go back and let's review the words once again. Number one, please say stethoscope. Number two, radio. Number three, ladder. Number four, rake. And number five, scissors. Number six, paintbrush. Number seven, computer. And number eight, microphone. So these are examples of tools. Tools. That's correct. Now I want you to get your notebook because we are going to have a test. So this will be your homework. We have jobs. Number one, fireman. Number two, hairdresser. Number three, painter. Number four, singer. And number five, farmer. Now, I want you to draw, okay? You are going to draw the tools that they are using. So, you will draw a tool that a fireman uses, a tool that a hairdresser is using a tool that a painter uses, a tool that a singer uses, and a tool that a farmer uses. You can look, go back to these pictures, and you can find the tool that they are using or that they use. For example, number one, we have a fireman. So let's go back here. Okay, this one, right? This is a fireman. Now, you can draw a ladder. You are going to draw the ladder here. Okay? So it's very easy. And that's it for today's circle time. Teacher Donna will say goodbye now. And I hope you have a wonderful weekend. See you on Monday. Goodbye, everyone.